Ah, the Raspberry Pi. This little $35 single board computer. You get the W Raspberry Pi Zero, W you're talking $10. And boy, are there a lot of gadgets to go with the Raspberry Pi. And in this video, we're gonna do the top five household projects that you can do with a Raspberry Pi. First off is this voice kit. You will get a speaker, a microphone kit, an audio attachment, and all you do is you press the button and it works just like an Alexa would or a Google Home. You ask it a question and it answers it. Nova Spirit Tech also did a video on this of how to program your Raspberry Pi 3. So you can actually, all you need is a microphone. You can actually program it and get it all set up. So with a simple command, you can get it to respond to your questions using Google's Assist. Tell me a joke. One joke coming up. What's the first thing a monster eats after he's had his teeth checked? The dentist. So that was Nova Spirit Tech. I'll put a link to that video below. But basically, you don't need a kit at all. All you need is a Raspberry Pi hooked up to the internet and some sort of microphone, whether it be a webcam microphone or a USB microphone. Whatever you have should work. And there you go, a smart Raspberry Pi. Number two, we have a Raspberry Pi Zero security camera. Inside that box is a camera, a Raspberry Pi Zero, and a power supply. Uh, because the Zero now has the Wi-Fi built into it, this is a totally cheap, inexpensive security camera project. And not only that, it not only records, but it could send you updates whenever there was any kind of intruder or anything picked up on the camera, a dog, a cat, your neighbor's dog peeing on your lawn, whatever it is. So these people set up a script to make the Raspberry Pi act as a security camera. One of the other things that's kind of cool about this is with the Raspberry Pi, you can now get a USB hard drive and not have it boot off the micro SD, which is going to give you the ability to have much longer storage and much longer recording time. So as you see here, they just had a camera port, the camera, some screws. I mean, total, this project's probably $30 around there. Pretty amazing. So up next, we have Mr. ETA Prime with a jukebox. Basically, it's a Raspberry Pi 3 hooked up to a touchscreen display. The display runs through the HDMI from the Pi. You're powering the display from the Pi. The Pi is being powered via a power adapter. And then you have a couple of speakers. You can use any kind of speakers you want, um, as long as they're rated for the quick wattage to your amp. And it's very low on power. It's touch screen, it's interactive. A really cool way to use a cheap, inexpensive computer to power your home entertainment. Next up is making your house even smarter. We're more and more, we're getting things like the Nest and plugs that are powered by switches in your phone. What this individual did was he got his Raspberry Pi to automate his door lock. He has an installed app, just goes to the app, and as you see, when the red light is on, the door is locked, and when the red light is off, the door is unlocked. It's a very ugly wiring job. He has to plug in the Pi. You might be able to run that off of a battery, but you'd have to charge the battery every once in a while. So you can see here they had to wire it so you know when he opened the door, it didn't pull out the power cord. And then as you see, it's not red right now, so it's unlocked, and then it's locked, and then unlocked. And they're showing here how it locks and unlocks. So, I mean, it's very ingenious. It looks awful. I don't think anybody would necessarily want this on their house. But it just shows what the potential, the capabilities of this little single board computer actually are. So cool on them to try something out different, and maybe it'll get somebody else to make a much better design. Lastly, we have a Raspberry Pi smart mirror. That's actually a mirror with a monitor behind it, all being run from a Raspberry Pi 3. Just like the smart door lock, this is also another video by Hacker House. They make some really cool projects. So you can see here the monitors on the back side of the mirror, and it's like a little piece of film on the front that is reflective, but it still allows light to shine through. So you can see what the Pi looks like here before it's flipped and they're still programming it, and then they just rotated the Pi in the config file. So you can see now the display is totally vertical rather than being a horizontal. And there you go, just like the phone. News headlines, time, temperature. So what was your favorite? Was it the Google Assist Pi, the Smart Mirror Pi, the Smart Lock Pi, the Jukebox Pi, or was it the security camera pie? 
As you see, there's so many cool applications for the Raspberry Pi, and because it's so cheap, you have all sorts of cool projects like this. Don't forget to like, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, and we'll see you on the next one.